Tonight on Evening. An inside look at the Muckle Teo factory known as the House of Fire. When we come back. Here it's in the so Northwest, good. we love to stay warm and toasty, do we mm -hmm. not? Yes, we do, sir. Well, there's a, big, a company that's been making products that help us do just that for 30 years. Yeah, it's called Travis Industries. And our own Jose Cedeno, that guy, just went there and took a look. Welcome to the Travis Industries House of Fire. This is where we make four different brands of uh, fireplaces and wood stoves. This time of year, we have 500 employees, and we're making about 2,000 stoves a week. All of us have a relationship with fire. Uh, fire's got a, it's either security or it's a gathering place, it's romantic. This is Romeo and Juliet, a pair of welding robots. On the right, all laser equipment. There's a curtain of air that comes down between the viewer and that firebox. That's all cut on the laser. It's a direct vent technology, so we're not having any pollution. Gas comes in here, ignites, and it creates yellow flame gas fire. The first thing that I can see when I came here is how big this production is. A lot has changed over the four decades we've been making product, but one thing hasn't changed. We believed we could do it better. And just trust me when I tell you that this place is really big, but the most interesting thing is that they mix in old technology with the new technology. We do very specific patina finishes. When people take the tour here at Travis Industries, they're surprised at the technology. We've got lasers, we've got programmable punch presses. We even have an anvil where you actually hand make uh, some of the parts for these uh, fireplaces. We make wood stoves and gas stoves and fireplaces much the way you make automobiles or airplanes. Well, it does look like a Boeing uh, hangar, right? This particular building, uh, Boeing made aircraft interiors in it. And about 11 years ago, we moved in and started making the world's greatest stoves. 